वेलकम टू माई चैनल दिस इज सैम आई एम प्लेइंग हॉगवर्स लेगसी तो भाई अभी तो बहुत एक्सप्लोरिंग बाकी है बस टेक्स एक्सप्लोरिंग स्टार्ट ही किया है ये लंबा चलेगा थोड़ा क्योंकि Nice to see you again. Nice to see you as well. How can I help you? What do you have for sale? What are we in the market for today? Have I mentioned you're welcome to stop by any time? Go me send me again maybe. मैं हूँ यहाँ पे तो इधर चलता हूँ इधर से फिर यहाँ चलूँगा फिर इस तरफ आऊँगा इस तरफ आके इधर वाला मेन मिशन भी करूँगा इधर एक मिशन है बेसिक मैन ऊपर मिशन तो इस तरफ दिख नहीं रहा है शायद जाऊंगा तो शायद दिखेगा अभी फिलहाल इधर जो साइड मिशन दिख रहा है वो ये सब कर लेता हूँ ठीक है बाकी का बाकी बात में देख लेंगे मतलब मेरे पास दस हील है बोल के ऐसा नहीं है कि एकदम ये क्या था बेपर वाह के फाइट करना ऐसे कुछ नहीं है जो भी करना आराम से करेंगे ये क्या है कुछ तो हुआ नहीं This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. You got the Rebellion. Is this a new one? Incendio 
सिलेक्ट करना पड़ेगा ना कहा जाऊंगा मैं नहीं तो इधर उधर ही भटकते रहूंगा फिर फास्ट ट्रेवल करके वहां जाता हूँ फिर साइड मिशन करता हूँ फिर आगे बढ़ूंगा साइड मिशन में कहा भेज दिया अरे इसको हर वक्त लगता है कि मैं कुछ गलत ही करने वाला हूँ ऐसे Fascinating, truly fascinating. Wish I had the energy. Excuse me, madam. I thought I heard you say something. <laughs> yes, indeed. Talking to myself again. I find myself to be quite the engaging conversationalist since my husband passed. Madam Althea Twiddle, pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Madam Twiddle. You know, you might be interested in this. You young people love this sort of thing. My husband often ruminated on the mysterious statue just outside our hamlet. Some sort of archaic puzzle involving vases, he would insist. I stumbled upon it today when I had a burst of energy and extended my morning constitutional a bit longer than usual. An archaic puzzle? Sounds fascinating. You see, I suspected you'd be interested, and wait till I tell you about the rumours surrounding this particular puzzle. My husband Greville insisted that solving the puzzle would reveal a magical challenge of sorts. The man was intrigued by everything. He was about to try and solve it himself when... <sighs> Perhaps you could take a look. I'd be rather interested to hear what, if anything, you find. Where can I find this statue? It's not far from Irondale. It's down by the shore, near those old ruins. You can't miss it. If I happen to see it, I'll have a look. Ah, the spirit of youth. I do hope you'll be able to solve the puzzle. If not for me, then in Greville's memory. I should look into the statue Madam Twiddle mentioned. Looks rather dark in there. Never stopped me before. This looks like the statue Madam Twiddle mentioned. Why 
are there so many vases around here? Rebellion! I should try to find all the vases. I think there should only be a few more vases. Rebellion. Rebellion. I don't know if I broke it, but I broke it. I'm nearly finished. One more vase. Rebellion. about what happened. Battle arena. Oh, this is a port.
तक ये सब इसको रहने दे फुल रेड अटैक में अवॉइड कर सकते हो येलो अटैक अवॉइड कर सकते हो और नहीं खेलना मुझे
सब खत्म हो जाएगा नहीं चाहिए बाप रे बाप छे भील खत्म हो गया क्या है का मैं चैलेंज ले लिया यहाँ पे बाप रे बाप बहुत पावरफुल होने के बाद यहाँ पे आना पड़ेगा ओ चलो चैलेंज चैलेंज की तरह रहा मेरा हील्स भी वापस आ गया बात कर लेता हूँ फिर नेक्स्ट चलता हूँ भाई मेन मिशन करना पड़ेगा नहीं तो कोई लॉक ही नहीं खोल पाऊंगा मैं इसके बाद जाऊंगा डायरेक्ट हेकट ये बात करके हेकट डायरेक्ट हेकट Mrs. Tuttle, your husband was right. The statue was part of a puzzle. Oh, really? How exciting! Yes, I had to destroy a number of large vases, and that seemed to activate some sort of charm on the statue. Well done. Oh, I miss having someone like you around with a thirst for knowledge and a quick mind. Well, my curiosity has been satisfied. Thank you for that. Who knows what I'll encounter on my next constitutional? <coughs> oh, my husband. Ah, your husband, your husband. You visit me, no. नहीं सच में वो तो मार्क किया ना मैंने अभी मार्क क्यों नहीं हो रहा और क्या हो गया भाई इसको करने के लिए नहीं इसके लिए यार मैं सीख लेता हूँ पहले इसमें कोई ये नहीं है तो इसके लिए कुछ और करना पड़ेगा ऐसे कुछ नहीं मेरे को वापस जाना पड़ेगा तो यहाँ चलता हूँ यहाँ से चला जाऊँगा नज़दीकी है so we have to complete one a certain mission i don't exactly remember the name of the mission because i saw that uh, in a video not sure how much fair in a place like this mission you can unlock uh, locks with alhamara so i should investigate let's go learn expelli armas ये तो उसका घर था ना क्या नाम है भाई उसका मैं उसका नाम ही भूलिया जो हैरी को लेके आता है उसके मगल होम से हालांकि मतलब दो तीन घंटा हो गया शायद जो मैं इधर उधर घूम रहा हूँ चलते जा रहा हूँ अच्छा पहुंच गया 
I'm going to go I had asked you to do. I need to speak with you. I need to speak with you. I need to Professor, I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Spellcasting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. Good work. The dummy is here if you wish to... Yeah, na explain us. Let's go to the Lumos. Expelliarmus, you seem to have the right end of the stick, but keep practicing. Expelliarmus may save your life one day. Professor, do you have a moment? I do. What is it? I wondered, did you attend Hogwarts? I did. I am a proud member of Ravenclaw House. Like you. Why do you ask? I was curious as to how Hogwarts has changed over the years. I see. Well, the castle itself, as I'm sure you have surmised, is full of surprises. I dare say more than the staircases change around here. As for the students, well, they seem to get more capable every year. Although. We got up to just as much mischief in my day as you seem to now. I used to look the other way at all sorts of roguery when I was head girl. I can tell you, however, that I did once admonish a certain Phineas Nigellus Black for enjoying a sugar quill during a lecture. Uh, I, I hadn't realized that you and Professor Black were, uh, students here together. <laughs> Appearances can be deceiving. You see, I was once wounded by time itself. I'm not sure what that means, but it sounds horrible. Ah, well, it was the risk I took with my prior position. You may or may not have heard that I was an unspeakable at the Ministry for years. An unspeakable? What does... Uh, as you might suspect, I cannot speak about what we did. Suffice it to say, the job was not without its hazards. Now, I hope I've satisfied your curiosity for the moment. You have. Thank you for speaking with me, Professor. Keep up with your wand work. One must always be prepared for mischief, both inside and outside of the castle. Okay. So, this mission is Herbology class. Garlic, Professor Garlic, or a side mission to Digni Rai, a deadlands, deadlian keys, Kalawa, yet Chalta Ragawa, ye, ek din Makatami, Nevada. Shall herbology, herbology class can take a bad ye question mark for Iga. Shall herbology class cut them. Still a level three required upon the best level twelve and a vehicle. Kidna level upon Gavi seventeen upon Gavi. I'm going to go to the class. 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 I'm going to
मिल बेटा ये क्या कर दिया तूने पांच लेवल चाहिए था तीन लेवल चाहिए था सत्रह करके आ गया फाइट भी तो कम नहीं किया भाई फाइट भी बहुत किया मैंने बाप रे बाप फंस फंस के फाइट कर रहा हूँ तभी फाइट करूँगा इसका नाम प्रोफेसर गार्लिक है morning professor garlic how wonderful it is to see you again lenora dear oh here you need these for today's class uh, um, uh, a little treat for your auntie oh hello class please welcome the newest rose in our garden we do look forward to growing together How thrilling it is to have everyone back together again. This year will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in herbology is knowledge. The prudent herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacula than the bouncing ball. Now then, today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the mandrake root. Here. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? First, let's protect our ears. Now, everyone, grip the mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. को बस आगे भी से करना है The soil should envelop the root like a warm dirty blanket putting the mandrake right at ease Repair I'm very sorry about that yours was a bit mature I'm afraid All right then off you go Splendid work, everyone. Yeah, class. Now for our next task, we'll be planting dittany at our potting tables. You can all get started. The best time to plant a seed is last season. The second best time is now. I do wonder about Professor Fig. He's hardly ever in his classroom. Most strange. Did you know that you can use the mandrake to defend yourself? Why the very idea? I should think Professor Garlic would be more careful with her mandrakes. Sab koi baat nahi karta na. Yes, assignment. Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. Actually, I enjoyed it. I couldn't help but catch your enthusiasm. How kind of you. It seems you're already taking to herbology like a mandrake to fresh soil. Now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Pick them up in Hogsmeade. You visited the magic neep. Wonderful. A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the classroom. It wasn't easy to spare one on such late notice. Plant the seeds there now, and you can return to harvest them later. Even with soil, sunlight, and a bit of magic, they will take time to grow. Let's see how to balance my star thistle arrangement: mithras fancy or roses. Dittany's restorative properties make it a vital ingredient in the Wiganweld potion, as you all should know from Professor Sharp's class.
दस मिनट बाद Once it can be harvested, your dictionary will be ready to use in Wigan Health Potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about that. Now, what say we branch out, introduce you to a different sort of flora, the Chinese chomping cabbage. You'll find that some plants are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately, I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Dear, dear, and let them have a good chomping. Yes, Professor. They're in the other greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading out of this room. Your classmate, Mr. Pruitt, has kindly offered to accompany you. Come back and see me when you're finished. Oh, and mind your fingers. They do bite. Where are you? Hello. Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. I'll be showing you the Chinese chomping cabbages. Up these stairs will take us there. But you'll lead. Nice work in defence against the dark arts, by the way. Excuse me. Your jewel is Sebastian, and he's good. Huh. Thinks he's really good. But you have I slaughtered him. It was brilliant. Oh. Well, thank you. I nearly put Sebastian in his place myself. I mean, I would have if Hecate hadn't stopped me. Here we are, home of the chum. Now, just toss the cabbages at it, and down with the rest. I'm sorry. What do I need to do? Garlic says she wants you to have a go at tending the cabbages. Give them some time to chomp and whatnot. Nothing to it, really. Just toss some of those Chinese chomping cabbages out. <laughs> You'll see fairly quickly why we call them that. some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the denoming, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. Vicious little bastards, aren't they? My kind of plants. Not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. The kind of plants that just have your back in a fight. I'm not saying you can't go it alone, but, well, imagine that wasn't a dummy. Trust me, Leander. I was imagining it the entire time. You were? I mean, of course. You're, uh, not someone to be trifled with. I see that. Dogweed and Death Cap has more of them, if you're keen. Other plants too. Once your parents wouldn't plant in the garden. You get the idea. Anyway, we, uh, probably ought to head back to class. Take your time. I'll see you back in class. Reminder as to why we should always wear our dragon hide gloves. I shall end our lesson here. Terribly sorry, Mr. Clopton. I tended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, Professor. Remarkable plants, aren't they? I hope they weren't too much trouble. Oh, don't see any bite marks or missing digits. And good, as you do seem to be quite green fingered. Oh, I'm eager to see your skill in the soil continue to blossom. Magical plants have so much to offer. I'm eager to learn more. I'm glad. Herbology is a bounteous subject. Tend to your garden, and it will tend to you. Huh. Well, I suppose that's everything. Do come by for a chat sometime. I so enjoy checking in with my new students. Look, 
mandrakes are really relishing their new Revelio. Only cost me my damned hearing. Eleanor Everley. So Eleanor Everley likes strawberries. Dung composter. And do I have? I don't think so. I have. I don't have dung. Dung composter. Keep this okay. So, what is this now? Potions glass, yes. मिनट हो गया पता ही नहीं चलता है प्रोफेसर शार्प के मतलब जब सेवरस सॉरी शार्प नहीं स्नेप का बात कर रहा हूँ स्नेप का पोर्शंस का क्लास जब करने आया था हैरी पॉटर और ये उसको तो बुक मिला था एक मेरे को नहीं मिल गई क्या बुक मेरे को भी किताब दे दे भाई जिसमें सब कुछ लिखा होगा अच्छा है इधर आ चुका हूँ मैं is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld potion. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld Potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Points for Ravenclaw. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a Wigan Weld Potion of your own. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Please be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous.
kadar kadar yerler yok. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more... resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished brewing. And we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time round. My parents considered keeping me home from school this year after the rumors of a home. Did I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office? He did say that. He wants me to get more ingredients to brew another potion. Brilliant! You, my friend, have been presented with an extraordinary opportunity. I'm Gareth, by the way. Gareth Weasley. Bit of a prodigy with potions, if I do say so myself. Pleasure to meet you. Wait, are you related to Professor Weasley? She's my aunt. Keeps too close an eye on me for comfort. Ugh. But she can't be everywhere. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Endurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single fupa feather, as you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission. Perhaps you could grab it for me. I don't know, Gareth. I don't want to get on Sharp's bad side. You won't. Fupa feathers aren't that valuable. Sharp won't even miss it. Very well. I'll bring you a fupa feather. Brilliant! Wait until you see what I'm brewing. Hurry back to me when you have the feather. Remember. Revelio. Your potion station's organized and free of clutter. Here's the fourth feather you wanted. Brilliant! Thank you! This is going to take a moment to brew. You should get back to brewing your Adjurus potion, and I'll tell you when this concoction's finished. Should you chop the Dittany or crush it? The wrong answer could result in the unfortunate loss of your eyebrows. Rebellion. I brewed an Adura's potion as you asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. 
You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. I'm sorry, Professor. I was merely trying to help a friend. Taking responsibility for one's actions does go a long way with me. I shall assume that you've learned a lesson. As for the work you did today at your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. I think each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. That was an interesting class. Thanks to you. Wasn't precisely what I had in mind, but it was still brilliant. I appreciate your help. I hope Sharp wasn't too disagreeable when you handed in your potion. I heard him talking about taking responsibility. Professor Sharp wasn't happy. Leave me out of your grand plans next time. Sorry to hear that. Hopefully he's already forgotten about it. Sharp may seem gruff, but I'd bet a few galleons he blew up a potion or two in his day. Best be off. Next time we talk, I promise, fewer explosions. Greetings. I understand you're quite the enterprising young Ravenclaw. Professor Fig tells me you found a long lost book for him. I'd like to talk to you about it. Okay. बस ट्रेवल करता हूँ Professor Fig speaks highly of you and your resourcefulness. He was vague as to details, but mentioned your having tracked down a difficult to find book. I wondered if you'd be willing to do a little detective work on my behalf. Of course, Mr. Ollivander. Sounds most up my street. Wonderful. You see, about a century ago, an heirloom, Applewood Wand with a fairy wing core, went missing from this very shop. My great aunt suspected a student named Richard Jackdaw. He'd been serving as an assistant here and suddenly vanished. Richard Jackdaw? Like the bird. In fact, he was known to frequent the Hogwarts Owlry. We searched there, of course, but found no wand. 
We did find a series of statues similar to Jackdaws. I'm certain they're a clue, but I cannot figure out where they lead. Jackdaw was last heard tittering about some pages with a map he'd stolen from Peeves. As you can imagine, the poltergeist was less than helpful. Why would the thief have taken the wand? I must admit I have no idea. From what I can gather, he fancied himself an adventurer of sorts. Always looking for trouble. In fact, after he went missing, rumor had it his ghost was seen in Hogsmeade. Never heard much about him after that, but it seems as if his adventurous spirit may have got the better of him. Perhaps he thought that the wand had some special power simply because of its esteemed lineage. Astonishing how misunderstood the art of wand-making is. Surely you could continue searching the armory? Oh, one would think. However, the headmaster does not take kindly to an old wand-maker loitering about the place. Can't say I blame him. Also, I have perhaps been looking for too long. I feel a fresh set of eyes, and a bright mind like yours is sure to solve this riddle. Is there anything special about the wand? Oh yes, it's terribly special. But not in the way you might think. It won't grant special powers to the caster, no. Nothing like that. But it will ease the hearts and minds of the Ollivanders to know of its return. And that power is immeasurable. I'll have a look for you. You've certainly given me plenty to go on. Oh, you've brought hope to this old wandmaker's heart. Professor Fig was right. You are a remarkable student. Investigate the augury. And what the... Why the... Augury is so far away. डिस्टिनेशन नहीं दिखा रहा है पता नहीं यही लग रहा है इधर क्या है भाई अब एक्सप्लोर करने निकले हैं तो एक्सप्लोर कर ही लेता हूँ थोड़ा बहुत इधर तो भी एक मिशन भी है दिख रहा है मिशन आप लोगों तो ऊपर जाना पड़ेगा मैं गलत आ गया पता नहीं ये मिशन वो मिशन अलग है किस सेम है तो ऊपर पहुंचने के बाद ही पता चलेगा Don't 
don't mind me, Owls. I'm just here to help a friend. Now, where are those statues? Rebellion! I recognize those handles. The summoning charm should do the trick. No statues here. This will do nicely. Birds aren't afraid of heights. Perhaps I should look a bit higher. Here's a welcome surprise. No statues here. Best keep looking. Nothing. No statues here. My best keep looking. Fast day, but hmm, a map. It doesn't appear to be connected to missing pages. Best hang on to nothing. No statues here. This will do nicely. I'll take that, thank you. Let's just some niche get on. Some of the niche is not on work. my puzzle after all these years good news if you've got something to hide you found the perfect spot richard jackdaw at your service the richard jackdaw so mr olivander was right she wants his family wand back goodness i'd forgotten about that wand i assure you i don't have it on me i'm almost certain i dropped it the moment i was beheaded in that cave oh it was sheer folly to follow that map what map Ridiculous, really. Found it on some yellowed old pages oh, peeps at Pilford. Thought I could impress a girl. But that's a story for another day. So, you stole a wand and then followed a map on some pages that you took from Peeves and followed that map to your doom. Odd to hear it all reduced to such absurdity. But yes, why do you care about some old wand? I don't, really. Ollivander does. It's the pages I'm after. Might they be with the wand in the cave? Indeed. Say, here's an idea. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest? 
I'd be happy to show you where to find them. I think I can guess how you died, but who did it to you? I was having a look about when I suddenly sensed a refreshing breeze, after which I felt, well, light-headed. That's all I remember. Hence, if you do visit the cave, be prepared. I can't tell you what for specifically, but you seem a perceptive sort. Beware a light breeze. Why would you steal Mr. Ollivander's family wand? The family were always going on about how special it was, so I took it. Who could resist? Sadly, it wasn't special enough to save my neck. I fully intended to return it once I learned it was only special for sentimental reasons. But as you can see, I never got the chance. How is it possible to steal from Peeves, a poltergeist? I didn't steal the pages from his ghostly form. I merely found them in his wake of destruction. He's got a penchant for wrecking things. Books, bottles, suits of armor. Whatever's likely to cause the most chaos. I doubt he even noticed they were gone. If that's the only way for me to get those pages, I'll meet you there. If you don't mind the sight of a, well, my decapitated skeleton, the wand and the pages are yours for the taking. Rebellion. So I'm going to start cutting in the next video. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for more. And do not forget to subscribe guys. See you soon. Have a good day. So we'll start with this ghost of all love.